Hey guys, RC here, back with episode 10 of Music Wars Empire. Well, I screwed the pooch. Uh, I had, uh, hadn't recorded this in a little while, about a week. So I was planning to uh, put Maiden back in the studio. And uh, so I but I was going through catching up on where they were at in the, in the scheme of things. And I noticed Maiden was not doing wow. anything. So I said, oh, well, let's put them back on the road. So we just booked them a new U.S. tour that's going to keep them on the road through the end of December. So everybody's on tour. Uh, Hart's in the studio. Motley Crue just came out of the studio. Let's check these guys. So their album, okay, their album comes out. Move, I'm already. Oh, the whole world knows now. All right, so this comes out on uh, Tuesday, and we need a whole week. So we'll just be going ahead and watching tour information. And uh, Hart will be coming out of the studio here in a couple of weeks. We'll put their album together. In fact... Uh, let me open this over here and open up Hart's discography because I'm going to need that here momentarily. Awesome. All right, so we need a full week of release, so we could, it doesn't do any good to look at Motley's new album this week, today. So we'll go one more week. That'll give us a full release date. Uh, Motley's music videos, uh, let's see, this one we will, Too Fast for Love, so let's go ahead and put one out there, and we will put the other one out, let's put that out right, let's put it out on the Sunday before, right there, confirm, All right, all right, so now, Let's go check out Motley's debut full-length album. Discography. Oh, it debuted at number 22, boys. Sweet. It's already made 300000 in revenue. Now, we do have a lot of advertising on this one, right? So, let's see. Let's look at record sales. We have sold our entire allotment. Uh, we had 27,000 sales, so let's go back to overview. Let's manufacture 20,000. Current stock. All right, so we'll go, I'm gonna go zero. I'm gonna go zero on all these. All right, continue. All right, now let's check record sales again. So yeah, they have not sold any physical copies yet anywhere except for America. But now we have 20,000 more. They debut at number 22 on the charts. That's awesome. Uh, 27,000 albums worldwide. Critical reception. Uh, a B, a B. Quality record, brilliant record, quality record. Four stars by C Magazine. Liking that. And let's see. Merry-go-round, live wire. We're releasing five singles. Okay. All right, let's go another week. Because I'm going to want to keep an eye, especially here in the early going, when they're going to be at their peak sales. So if I remember correctly, uh, let's see, Motley's music video. All right, so we did merry-go-round up here. Uh, we'll go there. Hearts album. Okay, this is the studio album. Okay, so we want to go, the album title is going to be Little Queen, and it is 10 songs. It's 
So we're going to come down here. We've got one, two, three, four. Oh, there's a nice one. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, those are scrapped. All right, so I got a 10. I like that. All right, we'll continue. All right, so in my opinion, the best song was the lead song. So we will take this one. We'll move it up to the top. And this was Barracuda. All right, the next song is Love Alive. Uh, I'm going to take the lowest song here. I'll put that up to number three. This was an instrumental called Sylvan Song. I don't remember anything about that. Uh, let's see. Dream of the Archer. So I think I want to save this one. I want to put this one at number six. All right. So we're going to go here. Dream of the Archer. This one will be Kick It Out. This one will be the title track. Little Queen. Treat me well. Say hello. Cry to me. And go on cry. All right, continue. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do that. I don't know. All right. Continue. Uh, let's go ahead and release uh, 15,000. Well, you know what? Yeah. We'll do 10. That's stupid. Yeah, it, you should be able to change that. That's that's bad coding. Sorry. <laughs> All right, we'll continue that. We'll do uh, local appearances. Little Queen, local appearances. Confirm. What the hell is that? Uh, close. Yeah, we don't want to put out another freaking album. All right, let's go just double check this. Heart activities. All right, so they're going to be album release date is November, November 15th of 21. All right, let's do a new release, a single off of a studio album and we want to do Little Queen and let's do Dream of the Archer we're only going to do two off of this album we will release this uh, December 13th okay continue uh, I don't think we're going to release any physical well you know what let's do let's do five thousand and we'll word of mouth and uh, that will come out when did we say 12 right there 
So then let's do another release, which will be another single. And that is going to be Barracuda, coupled with Cry to Me. All right, and one, two, three, four. Let's release that on January 10th. And we'll do 16,000 with that. All right, what date was that? January 10th of 22. All right, they're at 100%. We're currently on November 5th. All right, let's do some uh, book. Uh, let's see, let's create a set list. Studio albums. All right, we're going to go with Crazy on You, Dreamboat Annie. Oh, and then we want to look at Little Queen. And let's do Love Alive. Uh, Little Queen, let's get one of our big songs in there, a 70. And then we'll do Cry to Me. And we'll come back to Dreamboat Annie. And we'll do Magic Man. How deep it goes, that's awesome. All right, back to Little Queen. And we will do... We already did Love Alive. We did Little Queen. Dream of the Archer. Treat Me Well. Go On Cry and close out with Barracuda. All right, so let's book some media. All right, we're actually getting a pretty good list here. All right, so latest album, we'll release that ahead of time. Latest album, the day after it comes out. I think that would be good. All right, a small blurb about it a couple of days later. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so we got down to fairies. Before we do anything else, let's book a tour. All right, let's do a US leg, uh, below basic. We're gonna do 12, let's do $15 tickets. And let's do a short tour medium all right so i'm going to put here we're going to be doing under a thousand at 15 bucks that'll help me keep remember size and ticket prices all right we'll do a short medium 12 dates let's start that on thursday the 19th nobody wants to play and that is fine okay so we're going to be out on tour through december 7th we'll send them back out on tour of course but that's going to be that's going to be not applicable all right so we want to go back into media all right fresh music Right there, Gossip Girls, right there, Pop Waves, Prospects, okay, this will be right after, so that's good, Sound Waves, did we just do that one? No. All right, Substance, we'll go here, the Come Up, 
right there. The heat seeker. All right there. And trend. Out to the end of January. All right, so that has media being done. Awesome. Okay, that's going to be, so we'll definitely do a second leg. I just want to see how the first leg wraps up. All right, let's go into Motley. Discography. Down to, oh, we debuted at 46 in the UK and Canada. They're almost sold out. UK sold out. America, 17,000 last week. Yeah, I don't know. That's not right. I don't know. It doesn't say how many. 17. Oh, no. Because we sold more than a thousand. We sold 10,000 the first week. So 18,000. So 18 and 18 is 36. So I want to print 20,000 more. Canada needs another 500. And the UK needs another thousand, maybe fifteen hundred. All right, so what did I say? Fifteen thousand five hundred. All right, fifteen thousand five hundred. Yeah, we'll do another, and then I'm going to put zero here because we didn't sell anything there, did we? Uh, you, uh, Europe? No. Yeah, we haven't sold anything in Europe. So, nothing there. Number 34 this week. That's awesome, though. Good sales. Uh, let's see. Are they doing any shows? October 2021. Let's check Motley Activities. November 5th. All right, their video starting to come out, music video, and then we do have some clubs. All right, those clubs are going to go until the 25th, I believe, and I have that down. Yep. And let's check Maiden out on tour by mistake. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Shows. All right, well, they sold out the first show. That's good. So we're five million in the hole, though. So that's how quick money can go. So spending the money on Motley's album, boom. Losing money on some tours, boom. Um... So Motley's already flexing their creative muscle. So we had a we had a 360 deal for five albums. And now they're trying they're they want out of that. Uh, so a fair offer would be of around 1.9 million for the record. Standard royalty would be 5%. Creative control. Uh, I want I want five options. So two two and three quarters and what did they say here? Five point seven five. All right. So we just signed Motley to a five album deal. So they've blown it out. All right. Wow. All right. Let's go ahead and go another week. Hopefully we start making some bucks off of these guys. Oh, by the way, uh, real quick. Who was that from? Oh, that was from Coog. Uh, let's see. YouTube. No, not that. Uh, action. Welcome to the channel. 
Sauce1738RGF. Welcome to the channel. Uh, let's see. Thought I had a few more people join, but I didn't get notifications on them. I don't know if that means new older people have left and then come back. I don't know if that that's what that means. Because uh, Code Kid was the last guy that I got. Uh, let's see. Renato. Code Kid was back on June 13th. So that was a week ago. Uh, welcome to the channel if I didn't say that already. Cody Cameron I remember talking about. But welcome to the channel. Castle Prepper. Welcome to the channel. Oh, actually, don't not welcome to my channel. That was a comment on another channel. My bad. Tom T, where you at, man? I haven't heard from you in almost a month. Uh, anyway, let's get back into it. We went a week. Motley Crue's hilarious. So let's check. All right, Heart. Their album just came out. We need another week for them. But I do want to keep tabs on Motley because we need to look at those album sales all right ooh down to 8600 this week fell 10 spots in the charts all right let's see you're doing okay europe has now sold out all right so let's go to europe and put out another uh, we're gonna do zero 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 We'll do a thousand in Europe. There we are. Continue. All right. Let's do another week and then we can start looking at Hart's album. Forgot to write down Motley's singles. That's not the end of the world, though. All right. Hart. Well, let's look at Motley first. Discography. Too fast. 7,200. All right, everybody's doing okay. Man, it really tailed off fast, though, didn't it? Jeez. Uh, are you doing any shows? You are doing shows. The Bama Bar, 400 out of 400. Club After Dark, 400 out of 400. All right, so they're doing less than 500. And I don't remember what their ticket price is. I guess we can figure that out, huh? Uh, 4,000 for 400 seats, so that's 10 bucks a ticket. So... Ten dollars a ticket. We're gonna take this off. Fifty-five hundred was their high show. That's what that meant. And again, that's just something I do to help help me stay organized. Just because there's so much information in here. All right, looks like they're selling out every gig. Uh, Heart, how are we doing, Heart? All right, shows. All right, you're off to a good start. Selling out. Uh, at a thousand so that's good making money that's even better but look at this 10 million in the hole we are hemorrhaging money uh, let's see I don't know at what point you go bankrupt uh, let's see D -d -d discography there we are so T -t 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 little queen debuted at number 12 critic rating B plus fan rating B minus Critical reception, a brilliant record, a brilliant record, a quality record. So three and four stars, three, three and a half and four stars. Peaked out at number 12, debut week, 39,000. We sold out. All right, so we need to probably do, let's manufacture 17,000. I'll go with that. I'll take the game's suggestion. So the album's already made 420000 in revenue. Good. Chart trajectory, number 12, and number 23 in the world. We've got new records on tap, 17000 And Maiden, how are you guys doing on your tour? 
Uh oh. 10,000 seat arena. They only sold 39.23. That's rough. 852 the second night. We had uh, 1591 out of 9,000. And almost 4,800 out of 9,000, a little over half. So, yeah, we're not quite good enough to be, be up to there. Now, a lot of that could have to do with regions. So, like Idaho sold out 5,000. Mississippi sold out 3,000 one night. Jersey sold out four nights at the pit. Rhode Island sold out 2,500. So we're moving into areas that we just haven't been in before, possibly. Let's take a look at uh, popularity. Yeah, so see Midwest, New England, South, Southwest. So we aren't, they just aren't pop, quite popular enough, but we've got to put them out there, right? So you either do small club tours and, and, and you, you make smaller tours that are regional or you do a, a nationwide tour and you take the good with the bad, I guess. Um, all right, let's do another week. How are we doing on time over here? It's just about time to stop for this episode. All right, best-selling singles. All right. Well, here's the yearly. So let's see. Best-selling singles, best-selling albums. None of our guys. None of our guys, which is fine. Molly Crew is hilarious. All right, let's check our bands. Let's look at profile awards. And we are in 2021, so nothing there. Profile awards, nothing there. Motley Crue. All right, so Buzz, the Buzz New at the Buzz Factor, Breakout Act at the English Choice, Best New Act in Asia. That was in 2021. All right, let's check Heart again, discography. Record sales, 28,000. So I think we're probably going to need some more in the U.S. So let's manufacture. All right, we'll go with that. We'll do that. Uh, let's do... Um, when does this come out? 1213. Okay. Let's do a music video for Barracuda. Activities. Music video. Barracuda. Uh, professionals. Rap, pop, alternative rock. We'll select and close. Uh, themes, Barracuda. What kind of theme do we want? Well, we definitely want something with vocals, popular instruments. Production. So I, I, want, I want this red and purple. Twenty percent, twenty percent. Perform well. Performance video. That there we go. Uh, we're gonna set that to be done here and finalize. And then let's check your shows because we should. We're almost done. 
All right, so spritzers was a thousand sold out. Heist sold out. Ditch sold out. Okay. Uh, pinball. 4,500 people. Oh, okay, wow. Interesting. Wonder why they have, well, they have so many dates, man. Like, it's like a week-long thing. That's interesting. Um, all right, let's go to here. We're going to book a tour. All right, let's think about this for just a second. So they're selling out at under a thousand at 15 bucks. So let's do a new tour. This will be Heart Little Queen 2. Uh, let's do a UK tour. We're going to do none. We're going to do 10 bucks. It'll be short, small venues, 12 dates. Let's take a couple of weeks off. We'll start there in January. And then let's book another tour. This will be Little Queen 3. And we will do Canada. We'll do 10. And we'll do here in February. Okay. So February 18th of 22. And that's going to be Canada and the UK. So smaller, smaller venues. And so that's going to be less than 500 at 10 bucks. This was in the US. This was elsewhere. How are we doing? December 3rd. Uh, let's see. I, got, I forgot to close that and it got lost. All right, uh, Motley Crue, Profile, Discography, Too Fast, 5,900, we're number 57 on the chart still, 73, probably got enough for another week left here, we're doing good here, sadly. I was hoping to get to a, I don't know. I don't know why I was hoping for a half million copies on this album. I know that's unrealistic, but here's what it is. Best selling album, 82,000 copies. Uh oh. Oh man, my wife's freaking out, so she'll probably call me here in a second. Maiden, how are you guys doing? All right, we are doing some 9,600 out of 12. That's, that's not bad. Where's that at? Washington Stadium? All right, so we, they've, got a, they've got a little ways to go. Probably going to lose a million dollars on that tour. Really need to dial it back, I think. You know, I was hoping that, you know, these albums would start generating some money. Let's see, discography. All right, well, that one's made 753000 but when you're $10 million in the hole? Um, back, close. 
Maiden. Maiden's on tour. What did their last album do? So their last album was Number of the Beast. So it made $4.7 million in revenue. Almost one point nine in cost. So could have been better. And then Motley. Discography. So they've they've made see we paid out three point three in advertising and we've only made eight hundred and fifty nine thousand in sales. So I, I jumped the gun here. I really jumped the gun just because it was Motley Crue, and I knew I did. So anyway, uh, that is what it is. All right, guys, well, let's put a cut in here, and uh, I will try to get through the end of these tours. We'll try to get uh, Motley reset. Uh, put. Let me make a note here. Go back into the stadium. Uh-oh, hold on. Uh, uh, not go back into the stadium, go back into the studio after current tour. <laughs> that way I don't forget. All right, guys, well, hit the like button, subscribe. A couple of the new guys that uh, joined the channel was for this game. So, again, welcome to, uh, to the new subscribers. Uh, much appreciated. If you have any input, one of the guys said he... Uh, He's played over 5,000 hours of this game. So, dude, definitely give me some comments. Give me some feedback. Let me know what I can do um, to tweak this. And, uh, yeah, look forward to hearing any information so I can dial this up and get my boys to the next level. Have a good one, and we will talk to you next time. Bye.